All right, 722, your hurricane headquarters update. Watching this wave here that's actually flaring up in the uh, Bay of Campeche here, southwest Gulf of Mexico, 50% chance of development, but it moves into Mexico. I think we could get at least a depression out of this today. There is a uh, barrel, and then this is 96L with a 70% chance of developing running right behind barrel. You can see the wave that right there, it's actually looking pretty good, but look at the eye forming on barrel. We do have the hurricane warnings for Barbados and St. Lucia. Cat four expected late tonight into early tomorrow morning. That means winds of about 130 miles per hour, although I think the core of those winds will stay just to the south of those main islands. Now, as it moves across the Caribbean, it will actually get caught up with some, some dust. Saharan dust will catch up with it, but still we're going to get decent winds for Jamaica and then Grand Cayman as it moves by as we get into Wednesday night, well, Tuesday night and Wednesday night, and then it moves back over towards the Yucatan. But this is over towards Cozumel by about Thursday night. All right, so there's lots of cruises going in that direction as well. The forecast models do tend to want to bring it off to the north and the west, so even Texas will have to keep an eye on this, although it will be a weakening storm after that. There's the second storm right there, and you see nothing really going with that one. That one really gets caught up in the Saharan dust, and that should help dry it out and wear it away just a little bit.